Good day, YouTube. This is Jay Money with Falling Forward Financial. Uh, just a, a new uh, stock that I found here, uh, Peak Fintech Group. Uh, I've covered uh, quite a few uh, fintech um, stocks on the channel, and um, a lot of people are into fintech. And uh, come across this one, and uh, looked kind of interesting, so I thought I'd do a uh, video on it. So again, this is Peak Fintech Group, ticker PKKFF. Uh, if you don't know what they are, they're a, a Canada-based financial technology company. The company's subsidiaries use technology, analytics, and artificial intelligence to create an ecosystem of lenders, borrowers, and other participants in the commercial lending space. And it goes over some of the uh, subsidiaries there, founded in 2008. And feel free to pause and uh, go over that information. Here's a look at the uh, last year. So as you can see, over the uh, last year... Could have got into this at uh, 28 cents, 40 cents. It just kind of keep a slow, steady uh, climb up. Looks like it had a um, price and profit taking there, I suppose. Kind of traded kind of sideways a little bit and started going up. $2.40 um, sideways for quite a while, quite a few months. Started going down, and here it's starting to uh, take off again. So uh, here's a look over the uh, last month. So still not too bad in the last month, kind of on a, a steady climb in the last week, kind of a climb, and then kind of pulled back a little bit, and here's a, what it looks like today. Uh, Peak Fintech announces consolidation of its uh, common shares. This is dated on the uh, 22nd, as you can see. Uh, so the um, provider to the uh, Chinese commercial lending sector today announced it announced the effective uh, July 27th all issued and outstanding common shares will be consolidated basis of one and it's a little bit older uh, information so I'm gonna just slowly scroll through this one the consolidation is done specifically to allow the company to meet the minimum share price uh, criteria set out by the uh, NASDAQ stock exchange so uh, currently or eventually could uh, get this onto the uh, NASDAQ so in order to be listed on the senior exchange the minimum share price is only remaining criteria to be met by a peak following the listing application filed by the company earlier this year peak plans to announce the effective date on which the common shares are expected to begin trading on the NASDAQ in the uh, coming weeks uh, so maybe by I don't know, we'll see if it gives a date here. Maybe by uh, September, uh, we will see it uh, trading on the um, NASDAQ. We'll just have to wait and see. Uh, shareholders of the company approved the consolidation at a meeting held in uh, February 16, 2021. Uh, the ratio was written, uh, resolution dated on July 20, 2021. The company's name will remain unchanged following the consolidation. However, the company's plan to officially change its name from Tenant Fintech Group uh, later this year following the common shares of the NASDAQ, which will be expected to be traded under the uh, symbol TNT. So, sweet, TNT. Uh, for those of you that like uh, ACDC, there's a uh, TNT song, and um, so that just kind of popped into my head. So. <laughs> Uh, this kind of goes over a little bit more about uh, Peak Fintech, uh, Chinese, China's commercial uh, leading or lending industry. Uh, here we could go to their uh, particular website, commercial lending in uh, China ready to uh, peak. Changing the way a Chinese financial institution lend, uh, seizing opportunities, reducing risk, building relationships. Uh, so, fintech's kind of interesting. I've uh, covered a couple of different uh, fintech, um, SoFi, and quite a few others. I'll go ahead and link those in the uh, description. Uh, but if you're interested in this one, I would uh, definitely go to their uh, website. And as you can see, I just clicked away. Uh, you can get on their email list. The Cubular Lending Hub. So here it goes over the financial institution, lend brokers, and so on. Subsidiaries, Asia Synergy, Information Technology. And so definitely uh, recommend going to their website and uh, taking a look at that. Again, it's just peakfintechgroup.com. 
Big Fintech uh, begins acquisition process of banking AI software provider uh, with transfer of IP following successful pilot. And this is dated on the uh, 26. So a little bit older information. Uh, so we're just going to slowly scroll through it and uh, point out the uh, highlights. Uh, the signing of the MOU was uh, followed by a pilot uh, financing program uh, where the uh, software paired with Elements and Peaks uh, Lending Hub. And so I'm just going to slowly scroll through the rest of this information. Again, you can find this on uh, Yahoo Finance. Peak Fintech acquires minority stake in the China Union Pay subsidiary. This is dated on the uh, 29th. Today announced that it acquired a minority stake in China Union Pay subsidiary Rong Bang Technology. Rong Bang, Bang a Gong. Earlier this year, a Peak signed an agreement with Rong Bang uh, that allowed uh, Peak to use the uh, China Union Pay network to provide fund transfer and payment settlement services within the uh, lending. Uh, the network and implement the uh, services so kind of goes over some more information here on how to uh, connect a small pilot project uh, with a few select clients in May 2021 to test the services with live transactions level of payment settlement and fund transfer activity uh, picked up uh, considerably in June with over 1200 transactions during the month so it looks like it's a uh, active and um, growing company. This goes over a little bit more about uh, Peak Fintech, and again, you can go to their website there. Uh, Peak Fintech Group, a CEO talks Union Pay Growth Outlook on Power Hour. So again, kind of some of the uh, same information. So I'm just going to kind of scroll through this. Talks again about uh, Union Pay. Received an invitation to invest in Rongbang technology. So, if you have uh, this particular one, go ahead and list it in the uh, comments and any other information or a date that you have that's going to be listed at the NASDAQ that might be interesting to know as well. Sometimes the stock goes up once it gets listed, and sometimes it'll go up and then go down for some profit taking. So, it might be uh, one to watch if you're interested in this one. Uh, again, I don't give tax, legal, or trading advice, just state my opinion. Peak Fintech launches new still trading platform as part of Business Hub ecosystem, and this is the newest article that I could find uh, listed here today. Innovative Fintech service provider and manager of Cubular Business Hub uh, today announced that it had launched a new platform to cater to the specific needs of the still industry in uh, China as part of the Cubular Business Hub ecosystem. The uh, newly launched uh, Link Steel platform allows uh, still industry participants to buy and sell a large variety of still products, obtain value-added services and related transactions such as financing. And so just going to slowly scroll through this one again. Uh, again, you can find that on uh, Yahoo Finance. Over here to uh, Reddit. 24 days ago. See if there's any update uh, relevant information. 14, 15 days ago. I'm over here to um, StockTwits. Currently at $4.78 with a low of $0.29, cents, high of eight fifty one. dollars uh, The stock will 35 times in uh, 5 years. Uh, could be hit 450 and I'll put in uh, 15,000. Another huge step for uh, future growth to uh, peak. Link Still Platform will be marketed in the Gateway Business Hub for the country still industry. Uh, we just talked about that and went over the article. And. So, it <laughs> could be a definite uh, long term play. Uh, just have to uh, watch this one. Uh, waiting for the money transfer to add an extra 25000 in it. I'm so high on the stock. Uh, there you go. Some people are high on the stock. I'm tired of watching this every single day, not knowing my shares are locked in for three to five years. And over here to uh, tip ranks. 
and nothing currently on tip rank so kind of interesting uh, maybe it's too new of a stock or too speculative um, produce no products so but on its way to the NASDAQ and uh, we'll see what this one does and uh, see if it continues to grow and um, well, like I said it usually sometimes shoots up not as much as this um, but when it's listed but could um, go up and then come back down I've seen that uh, happen before when they are listed so just be prepared for that set your stops alerts just uh, whatever you do to, to uh, protect yourself and um, if you have this one go ahead and list in the comments any other information you have on this one uh, that would be relevant uh, that we could share and um, as there's a lot of good uh, fintech plays out there some are better than others and um, that way we could all share the information and uh, make money together that's what it's all about building the community here on the channel and sharing information so and if you haven't smashed that like button yet go ahead and hit that for me as well as subscribing and hit the bell so you're notified of when the next videos drop again this is j money falling forward financial happy trading happy investing stay green cheers